Welcome to the June 10th, 2024 construction update for the Gordie Howe International Bridge Project. The alignment process has begun. Beams have been connected to the exterior girders on either side of the bridge decks. I can't imagine it will be much longer before they are ready to drop the mid-span closure into place, completing the joining of the bridge decks. The bridge deck is being constructed from both the Canadian and U.S. sides. To connect the gap, a final segment measuring around 11 meters 36 feet, will be installed during the mid-span closure process. The two ends of the bridge deck will be carefully aligned and the final segment will be lifted into place, completing the connection. It is anticipated that the mid-span closure and the connection of the two sides of the bridge deck will be achieved by the end of June 2024. It looks like they are right on target, maybe even a little ahead of their target. Once connected, the full bridge deck spanning between the two iconic towers will measure 853 meters, 0.53 miles, making it the longest main span of any cable stayed bridge in North America and the 10th longest in the world. However, even after the deck connection, there will still be substantial work remaining before the bridge opens for traffic, which is expected in the autumn of 2025. The mid-span closure marks a significant milestone in the construction of the Gordie Howe International Bridge, physically connecting the two nations and representing the international cooperation between Canada and the United States. Enjoy the rest of the flyover.
Connecting of the bridge decks is an awesome milestone many bridge enthusiasts have been waiting for. I will stay vigilant to capture what I possibly can of the insertion of the mid-span closure section. The reconstruction of Sandwich Street is moving along at an impressive pace as well. Sandwich Street runs east from Broadway Street, hugging the Gordie Howe Bridge property, and continues east through Sandwich Town to the roundabout adjacent the Ambassador Bridge. This is an important upgrade for the west end of Windsor. The west side of town has earned a less than shining reputation in past decades. Sandwich Town is an old part of Windsor and Sandwich Street's condition reflected its age. The replacement is refreshing and well deserved. The Gordie Howe Bridge Project is injecting positive changes for the neighborhoods on both sides of the border. Kudos to the management and workers on this incredible infrastructure project. Let me know in the comments if you think the mid-span closure section will be inserted before the end of June, or will they wait to celebrate the joining of our countries over the Detroit River between Canada Day on July 1st and the USA Independence Day on the 4th of July. Like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. This is Bob Jones. And I will see you in the next video.